We tend to take the little things for granted. <sighs> yeah, they shot this right now. I shot him six times. Sometimes all I want. I am aggression. I am aggression. I shot him six times. I am aggression. 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 I am I live on the Cape Flats. Growing up here was fun. And at times, very challenging. One evening while playing soccer, we heard screaming. And as kids, you don't wait, you run. We ran into my house and suddenly gunmen opened fire on us. 14-year-olds now diving on the floor to dodge bullets. My friends and I caught one bullet each. It went quiet, and I heard my neighbors knocking on the door, screaming. I really just wanted to give kids in my neighborhood a reason to be curious and to spark a little bit of hope that they could do it too. I started to search for peace everywhere. And I found it somewhere I'd never thought to look in the calmness of the ocean. I put on a mask for the first time. I remember how scared I was. Terrified on the surface. Terrified that creepy soundtrack of Jaws started playing in my mind. Once I saw nothing was out to get me, I started noticing the beauty our ocean had. I got very sad thinking, why hasn't anyone brought me to do this before? I live 40 minutes away from the ocean. Why has it taken me 33 years to finally experience this? The more I dived, the more in love I fell. The feeling of being weightless, being able to fly through the great African sea forests, building a connection with creatures that allow you into this space. 
so that you feel as if you became an underwater being yourself. I found a magical world of peace, beauty and life. Now I explore it without a sound on one breath. On discovering this new world and knowing only a handful of people knows about it makes it my duty to show it to others. The biggest reason for doing what I do is my three nieces. My one niece, Akifa, who lives with me, has fallen in love with all that I do. I believe that only once we learn about something, will we fall in love with it. And only once we love something, we would want to protect it with every fiber in our being. I never imagined that I, a Muslim guy from the Cape Flats, with no university education, once terrified of the ocean, would now be teaching our youth. I hope to learn even more in order to do my best to conserve both humanity and nature. Through me, I want our youth to see that no matter where you come from or what your situation is, with hard work, we can rise above anything.